Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'll tell you how to fix iPhone stuck on verifying update. So in this video, I'll tell you how can you fix this problem. But first, subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos and hit the like button. So let's start the video without wasting any time. The first step is force reboot iPhone. A quick and effective solution to fix an iPhone stuck on verifying update screen is to force restart the device. This process will kill the stuck update process and clear any temporary software glitches that may be causing the problem. For this, you just need to press and hold the volume down button and the power button all together. And then a slider will appear, so slide to power off. And after some time, press the power button again until you see the Apple logo on your home screen. And you are done. And the next step is delete the downloaded update. For this, go to settings on your iPhone. Next, choose general. And then choose iPhone storage. Next, scroll down. And then tap on show all. Next, scroll down. And then find the iOS update in the list and then tap it and then select delete update to remove the downloaded update and then tap on delete update again. Next retry the update for this return to settings and then choose general and choose software update wait until the page is loading and then retry the update and you are done. And the next step is update iPhone with iTunes and Finder. If your iPhone is still stuck on verifying update screen and you don't want to use a third party solution, iTunes or Finder are good options. Simply connect your iPhone to your computer using the USB cable. Open iTunes on your Windows PC or Finder if you are on Mac OS. Check your iPhone in iTunes or Finder then choose update and update when prompted and follow the on screen prompts to allow the process to begin. And you are done. And the next step is free up storage space. For this go to settings on your iPhone. Next, go to general option and choose iPhone storage and make sure you have at least 10 GB free storage. If your iPhone is running low on storage, delete unnecessary apps, photos and videos to free up storage. Once you have cleared up enough space, try the update again. Having enough available storage will prevent any errors and allow your iPhone to update to the latest iOS version without any problem. And you are done. And the next step is reset network settings. For this, go to settings. Next choose general, scroll down to the bottom and choose transfer reset iPhone and then choose reset and choose reset network settings. It will ask you to enter your passcode so enter your passcode and follow the on screen instruction. Your iPhone will reset all network settings including Wi-Fi networks, password and cellular settings and then reconnect to a stable Wi-Fi network and attempt to update your device again. This may resolve any network related issues and allow the update to complete smoothly. Keep in mind that you will need to re-enter Wi-Fi password after resetting network settings and you are done. I hope this video will help you to fix iPhone stuck on verifying update and also let us know in the comments below if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.